This is the mission director. Go for launch. And excellent news. All systems are go for launch of Falcon Heavy with USSF 67. T minus 30 seconds. T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, engine full power, and lift off of USSF 67, go Falcon Heavy, go Space Force. T plus 40 seconds into flight under the power of 5 million pounds of thrust. Power and telemetry nominal. Falcon Heavy is headed to space. Now we did throttle down the engines around the T plus 40 second Vehicle mark. supersonic. In preparation for max Q. Max Q. And great call out there that we have passed through max Q. That's the largest mechanical stress on the vehicle on ascent. And incredible, incredible views there on your screen. Falcon Heavy in flight. Now next events coming up will be booster engine cutoff or BECO, followed by separation of the side boosters and followed by their side booster boost back burns. And then will be center core main engine cutoff or what we call MECO. Again, those events coming up here just under a minute away. That will be BECO. That's where the booster, the side boosters engines will shut down. The center core will push those side boosters away from the vehicle. Then those two side boosters can begin to make their way back down to earth with their boost back burns. And on your right hand screen, you could see the views from each of those side boosters. Really incredible views here. Again, we will have Biko, side booster, boost back burn, followed by main engine cutoff of the center core here in just a few seconds. Side booster separation. Side core booster startup. Incredible views. We just had Biko and separation of the side boosters. And you can see on your left hand screen that the side boosters have lit back up. They are now in their boost back burn, making their way back down to earth. Now those side boosters are returning to Florida under the power of three engines. That's three of the nine M1D engines. Next up will be the conclusion. Next up will be the conclusion of those side booster boost back burns, followed by Miko on the center core, as well as stage separation of the center core and the second stage, and then SES one or second stage engine start one. Now, as I mentioned previously, per the request of our customer, we won't be showing second stage views after SES one. And additionally, our center core or stage one is expendable today, so we will not be attempting to recover that vehicle, but we should have some great views like we are seeing right side now. Core, boost back, shut down. We should have some great views of those side boosters touching down for landing. Miko. Stage separation confirmed. <laughs> 